And now this all-time heavyweight championship fight ready to go. There's the bell, and here's Guy LeBeau. Rocky Marciano, Muhammad Ali, Cassius Clay in this, the classic championship fight. Uniquely, the two only undefeated heavyweight champions of the world. I'm rather staggered by the size proportions. Marciano about 5'11", Cassius Clay about 6'3", perhaps a little bit more. Marciano is the shortest man that Cassius has fought, and Marciano is looking at the tallest man he has in knockouts. To his credit, Cassius Clay has had two, among them Sonny Liston. Off the ropes again. A little bit more than a minute gone by. Round one. Marciano will occasionally leap forward and nail his target. A good body rally by Marciano. And Muhammad Ali seemed to draw gasps of breath as he moved back to the center of the ring. There's the bell ending round one. Marciano is at 195. Muhammad Ali Cassius Clay is at 215. One minute gone by, round two. Marciano at his best. He's got his man locked in, hammering the arms and the boom Jake LaMotta used to be. There's the bell ending round two. Marciano scored briefly with the left of the body just then. A good exchange. And Muhammad Ali lacerating the eyes with those short chops. And they're beginning to bleed Then all of a sudden, Marciano gets cut. As he did against Desert Charles. Knows. And um, now you've got the question, will the fight be stopped? There should be no doubt now about the ability of Muhammad Ali to take punishment and give it when he's taking it. Using the right a little bit earlier now. And suddenly goes to the attack. And suddenly we have a stand-up fight. Typical Marciano holding with the right, peppering the body with the left. But out in the center of the ring where the rock really doesn't want to be. A good look right here why these are the only two undefeated champions in the world. Clay Wilson. Oh, a lockdown and Marciano down for a brief count. He appears all right. He will take the mandatory eight count. It looked like a right to the jaw, but it was set up by a couple of shots to the body. A bloody poke. Here's the bell, and here's Guy. Marciano looks all right again, but the bleeding has not altogether been halted. And the Rock gets his licks in that time. Ali taking now. There's the bell. Marciano behind as he comes out here for round 10. And a driving quick start for Marciano, beginning where he left off, a pounding of the body. And he keeps it up, not taking much as he drives him here into the ropes. That is accurate bashing by The Rock. Muhammad Ali undecided whether the flurry with him, guard or missing his own counters as The Rock keeps it up, a relentless battering of the midsection by Marciano, and the best start he's had this fight. The Rock has been on the attack throughout in this round. Good flurry by Cassius Clay. Good recuperation by Muhammad Ali, and now he's leading. But The Rock drives on. It is a furious round for the Brockton Blockbuster. A slip. Marciano with rumbles wide open, and he's down, a left to the jaw, here's the count, two, three, four, five, there's the bell. The corner has not stopped Marciano's bleeding. Cassius Clay has taken a very innovating battering of the wind reserve. Marciano attacking at all points, that looping left landed on the head right past the guard, and Ali has been hurt. 
Ali in deep, deep danger, trapped here against the ropes by Marciano. Relentlessly. A left by the rock, and Clay is down. Here's the count. Three, four, five, six, seven. Very weak. Eight, nine, ten. Clay knocked out by Marciano. Apparently, the Brockton blockbuster completely diffused Muhammad Ali in the previous round. And here, found the root for the right hand to the head, finally finishing him off with a looping left hand. Rocky Marciano, a great battle with Muhammad Ali, and still the all-time heavyweight champion.